Second twenty prediction. My name is Narendran. Before going to Thursday's prediction, I will to review the Wednesday's market. Nifty ended up in the negative. Ten thousand seven hundred five point seven five ninety three point nine zero points in the negative. Zero point eight seven percent in the negative. Opened around. 10,818.65 low went around 10,676.55 high went around 10,847.85 let's go to my prediction review in our data uh, the indications uh, no matter how much positive it shows but we give an indication uh, because of uh, this uh, specific bearish level came inside the positive so that the market is still having chances to go down and as per the bearish trend uh, we given the uh, range uh, which is in the pre opening anything below that level and the stop loss level is not breaking means the market is still indicating bearish so exactly that is what happened uh, on this specific day you can check the market has opened exactly the same uh, in that range the pre open was well below that level 10818 which is below that level but somehow the stop loss is not able to hit 10858 so that is the reason market has still in the bearish trend so that is the reason market has fall down but somehow it has managed to uh, take the average of these two levels and the low is matching with these two average 10700 to 10650 if you take those two average it will match in the data exactly that is what happened if we take that average 10700 and 10650 the average is matching with the low 10675.45 and uh, the low is exactly 10676 and let's go to the prediction for thursday Thursday the indications are showing negative. Two uh, is to five, average zero is to three. Weight is zero point nine two percent versus three point one three. Absolute frequency evenly poised, which means the seventy five percent chances to bearish market. But still evenly poised comes means we need to play much more cautiously. And likewise the same what we saw on Wednesday, but here bullish uh, level came inside the negative. Uh, so we need to play a little ca- uh, carefully but still the market is uh, having chances to fall after keeping the high because of the scoring is indicating the market must have to fall so even though if it is opens gap up or maybe if, even if it is breaking the bearish stop loss uh, 760 uh, it may have chances to fall after reaching 10782 or 10804 those levels anything breaks resistance level 2 then only mm, and the fall is there but how much high it will go we may not know it may go to any extent after that uh, the fall can happen so we need to play much more cautiously whenever the evenly poised comes uh, so uh, it is uh, typically like what we saw on wednesday uh, in the negative side it is right now in the positive side but still Uh, the bearish is intact mm, the high is matching means the market will fall down uh, oh, the question is whether the pivot level is going to break or not because if it is breaking means we have a good chance to go towards to test level uh, due to that so all uh, we need to watch out is that um, after a gap up or maybe in the bullish market and um, we need to watch out first previous close stop loss is breaking or not 10695 this level is breaking or not first indication because of if that level is breaking means that is an indication that extreme bullish is going to control first point 
then after that uh, the second point overall average is breaking or not because the overall average is breaking means that is a second indication that the bullish will restricted so 10,000 624 the next level 10,624 these two levels are the key 10,224 so these two levels are the key so if those two levels are breaking means then the bullish will have uh, controlled because uh, the bullish level came inside uh, the positive and that is the reason uh, we, we are playing safe in spite of it is showing negative the negative is still intact no matter how much high it opens it will fall down but still we need to follow these two levels and this previous closing stop loss and the overall average stop loss one those two levels are breaking means um, uh, still we need to watch out the pivot level because if that level is not breaking the market having chances to recover but somehow the key which the frequency is having below that level so we have a good chance to break uh, the pivot level as well as the overall average level and previous closing level three levels are having chances to break and go towards to the test level and the bearish open and these two levels after these two levels only we, we we may get chances to recover but still there is a good chance to go towards 150 to 170 points on the downside today but still we need to play cautiously i uh, i bet uh, we need to keep some uh, call option as well as put option both side we need to keep uh, the positions due to this absolute frequency uh, which may avoid uh, uh, the panic because if we keep two lots uh, each side 10 10 rupees means uh, which side it is going to break it may give uh, some 70 80 rupees from those two bets let's see how the market is going to give us on uh, thursday i would like to give you the review i mean summary of the market this is the summary of the market.